Animation. I am vegan. Look at that vegan. Yeah, look at that vegan. Acting all friendly around that bird. You can see it in his face how hard he is trying to resist his natural predatory instincts. Yeah, resisting his predatory instincts. Top of the food chain, top of the food chain, top of the food chain. Top of the food chain. <clears throat> hey, hey, everybody, listen up. This weekend, Billy Bielsen's Slaughterhouse opens its doors for all people who are interested in how their food is made. But wait, there's more! You even get to kill your own food, drain its blood, and then take it home with you. Don't forget to bring your children, as we also have some cute piglets whose throats can be slit much easier. Come slaughter with us! That's correct, Meow. Meat makes smart, meow. Evolution proved it again and again, meow. Just look at the heights my intellect has reached throughout the millennia, meow. What kind of sorcery is this, meow? Plants have feelings, though. I didn't expect carrots to grow here. <gasps> oh my god! Carrots, cabbage, piggy, doggy, chicky, kitty, chop, chop, chop. It's all the same. Daddy said. <laughs> Are you crazy? What are you doing? Didn't like his face. Hmm. Good, Good point. point. Well, yeah, it may sound unnecessary to point out why we shouldn't oppress others just because we are not the same, but you will see what I am getting at once we have reached our destination. Which may or may not be soon, depending on how long it will take for these delicious vegan recipes to cross our way. <laughs> In our day and age, committing willful violence against creatures who breathe, love, feel happiness and pain is unnecessary and unjustifiable. We humans are a compassionate species, so... You suck! Don't force your compassion on me, you militant asshole! Yeah, nobody wants to join your cult of compassion. Eat a steak, you hippie! Fuck off and let me be! Letting animals live in peace is so extreme! Talk to us again when it's something important like a single animal being mistreated. Bacon! <laughs> Boo. Boo. Five thousand times more valuable. This is sick. So very wrong. I can't even. I totally agree. Killing is fine if we eat what we kill. We are so on the same wavelength. Should I go with? Oh crap, I never realized that my current actions contradict my own moral beliefs. From now on, I won't be consuming animal products anymore to align my actions with my core morals. Or maybe I am offended. Also, bacon though. Ha ha, checkmate vegan! Exclamation mark. Hmm. <gasps> Expectation. Fifty years fit and carefree come to an end with a quick and painless death. I regret nothing. Bacon, no. Ugh. Reality. Today is your special day, Dad. Enjoy your special breakfast. Oh boy, there is even some food under my pills today. But what would you do if you were on a sentient island that had only ancestors you could force your lines on, though? <laughs>
checkmate weekend la 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 so how did you guys get along ah oh, shut it you're a sneaky son of a broccoli mm. oh boy fruits i knew it and if there are fruits on this island that must mean there are also animals eating those fruits. I will find and eat them. <laughs> because lions. But just now I do wonder why nature wants me to eat animals when I also feel the deep desire to protect those beautiful creatures from harm. It feels so contradicting. Nature truly is a mystery. <laughs> Ah. Right, so you despise people who kill innocent animals for their pleasure, yet you pay others to breed, torture and kill innocent animals for your taste pleasure. Do I really have to point out the contradiction here? <coughs> this tastes like absolutely nothing! Listen, I know that salt and pepper are technically vegan, but how in the world did you remove even that? And how he's eating his weird vegan food. Blah. Yeah, weird food. Blah. And look how he is low-key trying to brainwash the people around him into becoming obnoxiously peaceful vegans like him with his fancy hoodie. Like, don't tell us what to eat. Yeah, don't tell us what to eat. That would never work on us anyway. Yeah, never. LOL, veganism is so unhealthy, must be all those fruits that make vegans fat. Snickers is a better health food. You wanna have it? No thanks, I am vegan. SAUSAGE POWER! MAKE UP! Protein, though. Do I look protein deficient? No, sir. Animals aren't as smart as humans, they don't contribute to our society, and in general, they are just different from us. Mm -hmm. Dude, stop this! Nah, no, it's fine though. He was mentally retarded, he didn't contribute to society, and he had a deformed body. Hardly human looking. He was just different from us. You are batshit crazy! He was still a human! Hmm. Good point. <laughs> we are on the top of the food chain, so we don't need to be logically consistent anyway. Might makes right. Also, I don't care though. Also, humans don't speak our language though. Also, deserted planet though. Okay. It's time to put into practice all the rigorous survival training I have gone through. Remember... Uh, oh, right. Oh, finally, one of those delicious aliens. Not that I need to eat you for my survival or nutrition, but damn, your juicy black eyeballs taste just so damn good. Oh God, please have mercy and let me live. I don't understand your language and you probably don't understand mine, but you surely are advanced enough to see and understand that I have the will to live life as I tremble in fear before your eyes, right? Right? First, I will pop out your eyeballs, and then I'm going to crack open your skull, take out your brains, and eat it raw in front of all those vegan hipster aliens on my planet. Just take a look at the horror in their eyes. They are sentient, just like us. Why do you want to keep putting them through living hell, all just so you don't have to change your eating habits? 
bacon though. Mmm, <laughs> delicious that animals. Nom 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 nom. You can taste their suffering. <laughs> Kill them all. I need more burgers because I am a very manly man. <laughs> lol, 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 lol. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I make sense. Whee! Hey everybody, it's Veneer. Well, who else? Uh, this little montage you just saw was a montage of almost all of my videos I made in 2017, which is the year I started uploading. About nine months ago, I think I uploaded the first one. Um, yeah, this whole thing was a rather spontaneous project. Uh, just today, actually, I cut it all together. So it was, you know, like the last day of the year, literally, I made this. Even though there were no new clips, as you may have figured, I still hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I tried my best to make them work together in a way that makes it hopefully enjoyable to watch. Anyways, I want to use this chance to just thank each and every one of you guys for all your incredible support. This whole year has been a very exciting and yeah, very good year for me, albeit quite stressful as well. Um, so without all your support, I don't think, I definitely don't think I would have been able to keep up the work on this channel just because of the many hundreds of hours I put into these videos, hours that I oftentimes didn't actually have, um, but still somehow managed to squeeze in. In the end though, we are here at the end of the year and that just rhymed. And I'm looking forward to see what, well, we will make happen in 2018. So stay tuned, more is definitely to come. So once again, thank you all so incredibly much for, well, all your support. Each like, comment, share, uh, subscription, and even sometimes direct financial support. It's all incredibly appreciated and yeah, it really... It really means a lot to me, so thank you so much. And yeah, I think that's all I wanted to say. So, Happy New Year to everyone, and I see you in my next video in 2018. Take care and bye-bye.